Oh no. Oh no. Sorry, didn't realize it was yours. I am flattered. But I'm a one lady type of guy. Huh? Oh my god! Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh crap, I missed. Oh my god, no, no, no. Uh -huh. Oh fuck. Uh -huh. Okay. Are they backtracking? Oh crap. Okay, she's down. Oh, come on. Reload. Can I reload this one? No, I don't. I don't have any ammo for that. Oh, shit. Checkpoint crank, okay. Oh, that's what I needed, okay. Ah, oh, shit. Wait, did, what just what the heck just happened? Did my stream die? Oh, I'm so confused. Did stream die? <gasps> oh no, it died. What the heck? Did it? Okay, I don't get it. I I don't think it did. 
No, it says it died. What the fuck? Oh, I'm so confused. It's... What? Okay, now I'm confused. Yeah, no, stream died. What the heck? Uh... I'm a little confused as to why that just happened. That hasn't happened in a really long time, so that's interesting. I'm literally running out of ammo. <laughs> okay. Why did she leave? Why did you? Oh my god. I didn't even tell her to. I didn't even tell her to come out. She's like, nope. Oh. Hello, Hiya Dreams. Welcome in. Uh, you, you actually just came in as my stream died. <laughs> my stream died and somehow came back, and I'm still so confused as to why that happened. Ba baby sounds. I don't even know the sounds a baby makes. What? Uh... Baby cry- uh... <laughs> I don't think I've ever been around a baby, actually. I'll think about it. Hold on, hold on. Give me one second. I need to think about this real hard. <laughs>
Why the way? <laughs> I don't know, because crying in general sounds exactly the same to me. Why baby impressions, too? That's like a weird one. <laughs> mm. Because it's funny. <laughs> mm. uh, I'm I'm probably gonna be really bad at this. Okay. Uh impression of a mind guy trying to blow up something for much. <laughs> I don't think there's a sound for that. <laughs> Honestly, probably if there was a sound for that, it would sound more like constipation. <laughs> Say it blows up a pancake with wine while your heart cuts out. <laughs> 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 no, making heart cut sound would sound like constipation. <laughs> because you make hard grunts when you're constipated. <laughs> Probably would be better at that if it was like, if I uh, ever watched that one anime called Saki or something, or Saiki or something like that. I don't, I do not remember. Uh, well, there's an audio. There is. Hmm. What would pancakes even sound like when they're exploding? I'd assume it'd be like a soft sound too, huh? Hmm. Well, usually whenever cars explode, they make like a really big boom sound, and then it's like... Uh... A 
think the alarm goes off too, but I don't, I'm not quite entirely sure. By the way, how have you been? I've been good. Um, just dealing with the shenanigans at work and just streaming on my days off. <laughs> and trying to sleep, basically. A horse? Nay! <laughs> Wait, actually, no. No, think about it. I didn't even ask what kind of horse. <laughs> I didn't even ask if you meant a horse horse or, like, the horse from, like, um, Charlie and the Unicorn- and the- what? I think it was Charlie and the Unicorns or something like that? <laughs> they took my kidney! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh. <laughs> A llama with a... <laughs> Carl! <laughs> that kills people! <laughs> <laughs> you said a llama with a hat. <laughs> if you don't know what that's referencing, it's literally, um, literally uh, a whole series that you can find on YouTube that's called um, Llamas with Hats. And it's literally about the these two llamas who are roommates and have hats <laughs> and the shenanigans that Carl does <laughs> where are his hands Carl <laughs> Uh, oh, why is there so much baby hands everywhere? Well, I was hungry for baby hands. <laughs> I absolutely love the heck out of that series, I swear. I think I've watched that series over three times at this point. I haven't rewatched it in a real long time, but like, oh. <laughs> it was both that one and the... Um, uh, and the uh, Charlie and the Unicorns one that I Ron from Harry Potter animated by Uni. <laughs> Love your song. <laughs> I've never watched that animated by Uni. I've never like seen the animated version by Uni. Probably have to like take a look at that one sometime soon. <laughs> kind of reminds me of the Snape, Snape. Severus Snape Dumbledore Snape Severus Snape Dumbledore <laughs> Leon 
<laughs> she literally screams his name the whole entire time whenever she gets picked up. It's like, what the heck? It's like, why are you doing this to me, Ashley? I was like, come on, Ashley, you got heals. Just kick him. I don't think there's anything up here, but I'm just gonna check it just to make sure. Oh yeah, because I I didn't fully check through here. Green herb. A zombie from Resident 4 in Spanish. Oh crap, I don't exactly know. Um... Yeah, I noticed that. Uh... Oh, I don't exactly remember the whole entire sentences that they say. It's because it's like one of them is se escapan or something, and then the other one is um para lord uh satlin basically is what they say. It makes sense that they that they're uh made to speak Spanish in the the whole entire time. You know what? I'm kind of curious. I don't think I have subtitles on. Does it when is when there's subtitles on? Do they actually uh, write out what they actually say in the language you're playing, or do they just say speaks in in Spanish? Because I swear to God, I've always seen things like that on like in movies and mostly movies, and I'm just like, why are you doing that? People are not gonna- people have the subtitles on for a reason. <laughs> uh, they don't translate the, the zombies, sadly. Uh, oh, that sucks. But they actually spoil the whole surprise attacks, like, behind- Yeah! Yeah, they do! Ooh, another alien headdress. That's kind of sad that they don't translate um what they're saying. Yeah. Or I'm going to throw you this, or I can't move. Yeah. But that's kind of sad that they don't tell you what they're actually saying. Because it's not like they're... um. It's not like they're spoiling anything by telling you what they're saying. Because pretty common things like, oh, they're escaping, or where are you, or, um, for the Lord Sattler, basically. So you'd think that they would, you know, translate it, but I guess not. Are you hurt? No, I'm, I'm okay, I guess. You did well back there. Seems this isn't your first time running from creeps. I can't tell if that's meant to be a compliment. Uh, fun fact? You can insta-kill the Chainsaw Sisters? Just- wait, seriously? I mean, I did hear that someone insta-killed, uh, one of the bosses in, like, under a few seconds. Wait, I don't remember if it was in this game, actually. Uh, you just need explosive bolts. Ah, uh, yeah, I have- I have explosive bolts, I just haven't used them. Uh, fully. Like, sometimes I use them, but... And shoot the bolts at, on the light bulb. Oh! Okay, and just set them on fire, basically. Okay. It seems like they... Both, um... The civilians and the civilians with the, uh, the tentacle stuff... Will tend to just, like, 
die really fast when they come into contact with fire. Uh, then after the cinematic, they just blow up and die. Seriously? Damn. Well, that's one way of dealing with them really fast without having to, like, go through your ammo. <laughs> Reload. Okay, we're good. Uh, now I want to know something stupid about golden eggs in Resident 4 and Resident 4 Remake. Oh. I know that there's a thing that says pick up. Uh... Four eggs, basically. Doesn't look like there's anyone in here. Uh, if you throw a golden egg to a boss, you take out 70% of the boss. Seriously? How? Jesus. How powerful are the freaking golden eggs? Jesus. It isn't worth it. <laughs> yeah. How come? Oh, why are you giving me more ammo and flash grenade? I don't have full ammo, or that's fine. Uh, I mean, it's not worth to sell. It's worth to use it to fight. Oh, okay. Yeah, I already, <laughs> I already got rid of the, the golden egg I had. I only had one. But yeah, that's understandable why that would be like good. Oh, so you encounter it again? Okay. I haven't encountered it again, so that's why. Okay. Well, that's understandable. Because of the achievement, actually. Because I, I think there's an achievement for um, completing all of the requests. I have honestly already messed that up, so... Uh, what? Oh, crap. Well, I gotta go back. <laughs> Never mind, I can't go back. Well, I fucked myself over. Whoops. Well, I can't get to that one thing, I guess. Cutscene. Right. Come on. Okay. Oh no. He just shrugged that off, I was nothing. Oh my god. I understand, they run away. What the? Come, child. Yes. Oh, his eyes. Run. Hurry. 
Oh, flee from the villagers. Oh, okay. Oh my god. No! Ah! Uh. Oh god! No, 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 no! Oh my god. No! Oh my god. What? Ah. <laughs> okay. I cannot just run away from the... Yeah, you did! I don't know if that technically counts as a death, but I guess I'll count it as a death. Because we failed the mission, so I'll just count it. Ah. Crap. Okay. Got incapacitated so fast. All right, come on. Okay. There's it. Uh, skip through. Come on, come on, Ashley. One down. Don't worry about them. Okay. Oh, fuck. Come on. Come on. Oh, crap. No! Come on, Ashley. Come on. Oh, no. no, no. Oh, my God. No! 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 Oh my god, no. <sighs> no! We were doing so good that time, too. Is it gonna be a repeat of that one area, I swear? That's what it feels like. He just picked her up like a sack of potatoes and plopped her on his, on his shoulder. No, like, he's, he seriously just did that. Just plopped her off. I didn't get that, um... At least the dude is, like, epic looking. Yeah, true. I didn't get the whole yellow thing on the wall. Oh, maybe I was supposed to go that way. Okay. Um... Come on, Ashley. Come on. Don't worry about that. Next. Oh, God. Oh, my God. No. 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 Come on. Okay. Oh okay. shit. I'm stuck. You need to go. Ooh. You got the kid. Oh no. I'm good. They're broken. Oh. Well, he somehow made it over to the other side. That's horrifying. gonna walk away. I'm 100% sure we're gonna see him again. But we're at least fine for now. Oh, one of them says, uh, what will we do? Okay, that's interesting. 
I somehow have a max of... Huh. Handgun ammo. <laughs> I've never hit the max for handgun ammo before. Listen, you're the one he wants. If we see him again, you run. But what about you? I'll do my job. Oh, hey. Those nooses. What? Matadero, and then I said, no pasar. So. No trespassing, basically, but I'm not entirely sure. Oh, Ew. Hmm. Don't remember what that Ooh. translates to. Breaks over, I suppose. Hello. Welcome. I was taking a break, what apparently. I, interest you in? uh, I still don't have enough. Or your life. I have okay. Come back and I have enough to put another thing in here and just to sell it. Need time. Welcome. Where would it so, what can I do you for? I'll get bangle. A deal well struck. <laughs> I don't think I don't have anything for this, so All my wares are in tip-top shape, I assure you. <laughs> Let us know when you've made some room. Move these over for a second. Come on, oh, oh. Hold, mm. press the button for Jesus. Out there. Let's get a 6.40. This is a 540. I'm gonna put this one away. See how that feels, man. Anything okay. else pleasant travel. The way he's holding holding the gun though. Just like eh. <laughs> that one's pretty good. Mmm. Okay, I'm gonna put. Oh, there's three bullets in there? Really? That's fine. Storage. That was a number two, so that means I'm just gonna have to put this one into number two. There you go. I'm taking up so much space.
I have no room for anything right now. <laughs> I'm gonna make a little bit more of the attachable mines, honestly, because I don't have that many. Hold on. It's a uh, three. No, that's not it. It's four. Oh god. Alright. Wait a second. I didn't save. There you go. Okay, we're doing good. Or as good as possible. Ah! No, it's fine. It's just money. I'm still salty that I missed this thing, though. That's like the second one I've missed. Yeah, that's the second extended map treasure I've missed. Uh, the one at the checkpoint. Basically, the area that has the, uh, yeah. The area that has the two, uh, chainsaw ladies, I missed that one. Because I thought, because I forgot about it. And then I continued onward. And that's when you basically can, uh, meet the, uh, Mendes dude, basically. Big boy. Big tall boy. And by then, no wait, no, actually it was before that. Yeah, because you just have to go in upwards onto a platform and then jump into a building, but there's no way to like leave from back where you came from that building. So, yay. Yeah, so I can't backtrack and get that anymore. I also can't- I don't think I can backtrack and get the other one, uh, expanded map either, because it's like, all the way back here in the valley. <laughs> missed that one. And then there's the normal treasure that I missed over here. And... Freaking savage mutt I missed over here and the <laughs> other treasure here and... There's a collapsible ladder here? Dang it. I missed things! I was trying my best not to miss anything, too. That sucks. Oh, we're almost to the castle, actually. Because that looks like a castle. And it looks like we're up about to get over to two treasure spots, too. Oh god. Hopefully I don't miss those. I think that's it for every item over here, so we're just gonna go onward. Be careful. Why are you telling me to be careful? Did you see something I didn't see? I feel like she did see something I didn't see. Oh. Oh. Oh my god! Oh no. Hide. Oh no. 
Is this a boss fight? This is a boss fight, isn't it? It's a boss fight, isn't it? Man, this is a nice guy. Grant me the strength to crush your enemies. Son of a bitch! Ashley, run! Okay. Run and hide. Hustle away, go. I don't think that's gonna. Oh my God! I thank you for your. Gift. Excuse me? Why are you almost giving me half? Halfway human centipede vibes here. Oh gods. He has an eye in the back. Oh my god. Ah! Oh my god! No grabbies! I'm gonna die, aren't I? Oh no, no. We're, 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 we are okay? Oh my god. Get back up there! Huh? Oh my god! I missed that space. Oh god, no. I missed the evade! Oh, oh crap! Uh, uh. Use that. <sighs> oh god. No oh, god! No. Oh my god! Oh, okay. Oh no, that is not what I wanted. Nope. He. Nope. Wait a second. There's an eye in the back. Uh. Oh fuck. Oh my god. Okay, I parried him. Somehow. Uh. Oh, that is painful. Oh fuck. Okay. Pretty sad to see his self off. Oh, for real. What? Um. Oh no. Oh no, this is even worse. Oh, gross. Oh, gross. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, no. That is not what I wanted. Let me back up. Let me back up. Let me back up. Oh, my God. Oh. No. Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this to me? Oh, my God. Okay. Ah. Uh, Oh, oh, ow. Oh, my freaking side. What the fuck? Okay, hear me out, done. After you kill him, do not go out. Please clean the place and take the item he drops. Oh, I was gonna make sure to do that because there's a lot of stuff I've missed around here on the, f on the ground and stuff. Also, most enemies seem to drop something, so I'd be surprised if he didn't drop anything. Three, uh, three, three. Oh my god, no! No! Ah! No! Oh my god. Get back. Ah! E! Oh 
my god, no, 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 no. Oh, this is painful. Oh my god. Oh crap. Oh. Oh crap. Okay. Oh crap. Nope, that is not what I Nope. Hey. Watch where you're swinging those things. Oh crap. Oh my god. Ah. Oh my god, no. That was bad. That was really bad. He's not close enough for me to use these. Let's switch it over to six. Uh. Oh, Jesus. Oh my god. Oh no, 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 no. Oh. Oh shit. Oh no. Ah, I was trying to reload too. Grilled big cheese. What? What kind of achievement is called grilled big cheese? Why would they? <laughs> Why? Leon! Oh, Jesus. Hold on a second. I think. I think I got everything. I don't think there's anything else up Leon! top. I know, I know. Hold on a second. Hold your horses. Hey! Okay. Come on, it's dangerous. I think we're good. Leon, hurry! Oh, Jesus. Well, we got the thing. You're welcome. <laughs> Thanks. This fire's bound to catch their. Okay. Uh. Three. I don't have any ammo for this gun, so.
can make some though. Okay. Attention. Let's keep moving. Uh, Leon, I'm not gonna turn into one of them, right? I won't let that happen. I promise. Oh, crap, my health. I'll have to use one of these. Oh, God. Wait, why is she all the way over there? Hang on. Okay, right, there we go. I can't vault over there. Ooh, vehicle. Accessory hair color red. What? Ooh, gold token. Oh, okay, I'm supposed to sell that. Okay, makes sense. Oh, there it is. Emerald. Okay. Well, that castle seen better day days. What is this? There's no, there's no water on, on the moat either. Interesting. Well, here we go. Oh, we're getting locked in. What's going on? Well, at least we don't have to worry about being followed. Come on. Uh, I hate my internet, but hey. Uh, did you with killing him? <laughs> Thank you. I'm glad I, I didn't die though, or fail at least. Uh, okay. Shift. Save game. <sighs> yeah, I, might, I think I might just actually pull this. Put that away. <laughs> or just a bit of extra space, at least. And onwards we go. Hola, Luis here. Do you guys still around? Well, I wanted to go home, but Ashley just had to see this castle first. Eh. Perfect, because I have a present I want to give you. Medicine that will help to suppress the progress of your problem. Where do we go? Let's see. Come to the courtyard inside of the castle. We can meet up there. Ciao. All right, Ashley. Luis just said. I got it. Guess we better get going. Emily looks pretty, though. Ah, uh, okay. Eh. My hands got wet. Let this burrito so soggy. Also, yes, I feel you with the whole my internet thing. <laughs> I hate my internet sometimes too. Like, I absolutely hate my uh, internet provider as well. Even more so because I live in the middle of fucking hell. It's pure hell. Yeah. Mm. I hate it. And I will tell you. When I first started streaming. 
my internet for some apparent reason was so freaking bad that my streams would die every 30 minutes and i was so freaking confused like sometimes it would go up to an hour but then it would die and i was so freaking confused about it for like the longest time until i found out that apparently someone had destroyed my outside uh internet cord with something like a probably like a weed whacker or something like because the cord was cut And the only reason me and my roommate found out about it is because we we kept calling and harassing the internet provider. Like, hey, we we got a new, you know, uh, internet box. Because uh, they're like, ours is a little bit old, you know, and so we got a new one. Where's the internet? <laughs> We're paying for shit. We ain't getting shit. What's going on? And they'd be like, oh, it's not our problem. And we'd be like, yeah. They're like, why don't you, like, you know, turn it off, turn it back on again. And I'm like, that's the first thing I tried. <laughs> if something doesn't work, just turn it off and then turn it back on. And it's like, that's the first thing I tried. Did not work. It took us quite a long time before they actually sent someone out to check everything. And that was the first thing they saw when they got here. And I was just like, are you freaking kidding me? For the longest time, our cord was barely hanging on by a thread. And I don't know if it was like by accident or if someone did it maliciously. Because the, the area that my the outside cord is, is literally right... Um right next to the grass so it would be really hard to like see where the heck it is uh for sure it sounds like they would get tired but <laughs> yeah definitely also like i pay well like we me and my roommate we pay for like the better internet um thing because they're like oh if you pay for this amount you basically get like more internet or whatever uh which is like, you know, for if you're doing streaming or like really hardcore stuff with your internet kind of a thing. And for some reason, sometimes they throttle our internet so hard and it's like, what the heck? Because we're like paying for shit, but they give us the the lesser shit and it's just like, what are we paying for? And I feel so bad because it's like, oh, it's the only freaking internet provider we can get out here. Uh, bro, we're scamming. Yeah. Yeah, boy. And then it's like, it's the only internet provider we can get because we are we live in the middle of nowhere. Um, And it's not like we live in a big city, so we can't, you know, get other internet providers. We only have like a very few options. Uh, and, and it's not even just us or, like, a few customers that they, like, fuck over. No, they, they fuck over a lot of customers, apparently. Like, the amount of people who freaking, who I've talked to about this company, every single person I've encountered, not one of them has ever said anything nice about it, that company. Like, I just bring up the name, and they're like, oh, yeah, it's it's that one. <laughs> I'm just like, ah. Oh. The fact that it has so much bad, like, infamy, basically, at this point, like, mm -hmm. At this point, it's basically, like, the same as my, um, health provider. <laughs> the health provider I have is also shit, as, like, absolute shit. And whenever I bring it up to people, they're like, oh, yeah. <laughs> I think it's absolutely hilarious sometimes. Well, that's a weird thing, funny thing. <laughs> I definitely agree. It's 
It's sad and funny at the same time. Yeah, definitely. Even more so for like the health provider, honestly, in my opinion. Oh, great, there's no cows here. Welcome. I've got something new for you, mate. Ah! We like our herbs, we do. Heal a man, kill a man. They do it all. <laughs> all kinds of trinkets in this clown's castle. Anything else I can help what? you with? What you see is what I've got. Ooh, Magnum. Ooh, 15. Nice. I wish this game had a revolver, not a magnum, but a revolver. That'd be nice. Okay, so. Oh. A well that. To give that the care it deserves, mate. So that's at 180. Oh, wait, no, that's magnum rounds. A new gun, stranger. That does quite a lot of damage, though. A, a semi-automatic rifle capable of rapid fire mm. your valuables won't do you much good in the ground a deal well struck <laughs> That definitely would be satisfying, actually. That cash in mm. your pocket or your life. I see you have an eye for things. Guns not just about shooting, it's about reloading. You'll know what I'm talking about. Go on, take this as well. Free of charge. Well then, happy cooking. Actually, isn't the Magnum technically a revolver gun? You'll get some bang for your buck, I guarantee. Hmm. Yeah, Magnum is just basically the um the ammo it carries, right? Oh, okay. So basically you're saying it, it would be nice if it had a different caliber, basically. Okay. Oh that looks nice though. Better than the rifle I actually have. It's a rapid fire one. Hmm. Molding a weapon to suit your specific needs. Oh, come back and. No, wait, no. There we go.
Oh. Register shortcut. Uh. One, two. Five. Okay, so one and five, basically. One is the basic gun, and then five is the... Um... Uh... Five is Magnum. I love the saving music. Yeah, I've brought it up before. But the saving music in this game... I brought it up in a, in a different stream, but, uh... I think it was yesterday, actually. But this music sounds exactly like, uh... The music... Uh... The bass music for another video game. And it kind of threw me off for a bit. Because I don't know if they did it on purpose or if they sampled. But then again, a lot of the music in this game is apparently different from the first one, so... Yeah, I'm like, I don't know, because I don't think that game is a, uh... Made by the same company as this one. Because, uh... The one, um... So the game that has the same, this exact sounding music... Uh... Is... A game called Tormented Souls, which if you don't know about or haven't heard about it, it's um, it's basically like a love story between uh, Resident Evil and Silent Hill. Yeah, this music sounds exactly like the base music for the game. Like while you're playing through it, this is what you hear, and it only changes when you do like enemy encounters. Uh, for me, it was something the game. Something the game? I mean, like, it wasn't that good, personally. <laughs> well, no. I- it's- it's very different, honestly. In my opinion, it, it was a it was a pretty good game. In, in my opinion, uh, I personally liked it, but I don't think it's basically everyone's cup of tea. It's like a mashup, basically. It's it's like if someone it's like if Silent Hill and Resident Evil had a child, basically. <laughs> That's what they were going for, and that's sort of what you feel like while you're playing it, sort of. Because of the small elements of both games that you encounter through the gameplay. <laughs> but like, as its own game, it's it's pretty good, I, I think. Uh, it was fun, but there was something a bit off of the game. I think it's because it's it's meant to be off, basically. Apparently, there's also multiple endings for the game. I don't know if it's just two, but there's... I know of two, but there might be more. Uh, merchant tip, the handgun for you. With so many handguns available, choosing the right one for you can be tricky. Lucky for you, we've compiled the list of the special characteristics for four stellar choices. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, so depending on... Uh, on what you do during gameplay is if you either walk out with the sister or if uh, you encounter uh, the sister much later on, basically. Um, basically, either the sister lives or the sister dies. It is, that's basically like the only uh, endings I know of. Um, if I remember correctly... Also, a little bit of a spoiler, basically. So, a spoiler warning. Uh, but, a, so... 
Uh, during the time when you encounter the sister while she's caged, uh, you can either continue on and just let let her be, and then go into the the end game area, uh, where she basically tells you not to go into, and that's basically like you know your uh, your basic go to ending where you encounter ba uh, bad guy and stuff, and you encounter older older sister but she's gonna she's basically dead at that point um i believe that's the bad ending if i remember correctly uh but if you don't go there and you just immediately go and save the sister you can actually just leave with the sister you don't have to go and defeat the the end boss you could just leave which is absolutely hilarious to think about because it's like, sometimes with a lot of games, you encounter those, you encounter the full, um, the full ending where you go through the entire game and you're like, oh, this is probably the only ending, right? And then it's like, no, that you, you could literally finish the game without having to fight the big boss. You just go. <laughs> Not for sure something, yeah. That's like, um, in, in Far Cry 5. You can literally not play the game. You can literally end the game right as you start. Literally. All you have to do is stand there. And don't even interact with anything. Just stand there and stare. Literally. Because, like, if you've played it, it's basically you go into cult area and you listen to the father talk for a bit and then you have to, like, uh, and then the cop tells you, uh, you can either, uh, cuff him, basically, but they don't hint to anything else. They don't give you any hints. So, uh, but you can end the game by just not doing anything. Just set your controller down, wait for a while, and then it'll be like, oh, okay, just leave. And then you, the game finishes, it ends. <laughs> Which is, I, I, it's absolutely freaking hilarious to think about because you don't have to do anything and it's like hey i think it's also like an achievement too so like hey if, if you're ever you know running for achievements on five uh far cry 5 that there's there's one easy way to get one of the achievements <laughs> Oh, that sounds pretty funny, to be honest. Yeah, definitely. Mm. Punisher. This one has a brilliant stability and penetration power. Oh my. So it's got stability and penetration power, huh? Okay. Good to know. A uh, laser sight that can be mounted onto it too, making it a very versatile weapon. Uh, Red 9. This gun delivers a lot of power, but it kicks like a horse. Keep it reined in by attaching the stock. I don't have stock for it yet, so. Uh, Blacktail. A great gun ideal for a quick shooting. A compact... Oh, it's compact size. Also helps free up inventory space. Hmm. Matilda, out of stock. It's a bit unremarkable on its own, but attaching the stock lets you suppress the enemy with three round bursts. Matilda? Oh god. Welcome. What can Wait, I so the you? black tail was- Oh! Well, that's what they meant by compact. There's like four. Your life. Wait, how expensive is it? 24. That's 1.40. A well-tuned weapon can make up for a lack of skew, friend. It's probably definitely a little bit stronger than Anything that one, probably. Time, buy something, eh? <laughs> well, that was a little... I was just checking something. I just bought stuff from you. Hold on. Quite a bit of ammo in here, anyways. 
am I looking at? Oh. I don't have the rifle with me. Wait, no. What is that? I'm guessing it's catapult. Oh. Courtyard's got to be through that gate. Don't think our hosts are going to roll out the red carpet. Hmm. I'm going to assume that the hooded people are not that good. I probably should, like, nerf them first or something. I don't know. I don't know, they gave me mage vibes. Crossbows, huh? Something tells me they don't want to be friends. Things just keep getting better. I'm pretty sure if they wanted to be friends, wouldn't they have, like, just come out and been like, hey, you know? Storage. Wait, I don't. I don't have any ammo for this thing. I just realized. Well, the question is, should I actually carry with this with me? Because chances are I might get, um, ammo for it. I don't know. Hmm. Then again, it might also be just a waste of space if I do that. British. A British impression. Hmm. Well, I suppose I could just keep on going. Oh. Yep. Why is it auto saving? I don't understand. I don't quite. Get the oh. They have horrible posture. <laughs> that is the weirdest way of holding a gun, I swear. Can I go this way? Hello there. Hello there. I bring gifts. Boot knife. What? What the fuck's a, bo a boot knife? Knife used for hunting. This basic mass produced item was made with affordability in mind, not durability. 
Well, at least it's better than a kitchen knife, I guess. Uh. Like this, what's in here? Gunpowder. What the heck is that sound? What in the world is that sound? Death. Oh my god, come on. Come on, Ashley. <laughs> come on, Peek. Oh, come on. Oh, I missed. gonna go first. Come on, peek. Oh god. Reload. Ah, oh, crap. I just realized I'm using the wrong gun. Why did I just use the wrong gun? No! I just used the Magnum. That's not what I was wanting. Oops. No wonder the freaking uh, scope was a little off. No wonder it was also hit one hit one shot hitting everything. Apparently she likes my shots. Okay. Interesting, because I'm not that good of a shot. Oh, 
Oh gods, really? I need 17 of those to make a magnum ammo? Hmm. I guess it's time I gotta start saving these then. Oh, that's for the front door. Okay. Quite expensive. Yep, definitely. Oh, Jesus. Yep, apparently they do. There they are, kill them, basically what they said. <laughs> Let's see. You. Come on. Peek. I see a little light going on there. Come on. Oh shit, hello there. Holy Jesus. Okay, come on, Ashley. Run back. Don't get hit. <laughs> I don't think she'd even survive that if she did get hit. But who knows? Maybe... I mean, she would be able to survive that. I don't know. Can I not go through here? Oh, I can't. I'm going to assume I just haven't gone over there yet. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. I guess this is their idea of a warm welcome. That's an interesting way of uh, dying, just sitting down there. Oh shit! Where'd you come from? I says, oh god! Oh my god! Come on, Ashley. We we gotta keep on moving. Apparently. Ashley, you all right? Yeah. Thanks. Uh. Look at you. 
Yeah, my shots are amazing. What about it? No, just kidding. They're nothing to boast about. Hello there. Get down permanently. Oh, okay, that's locked. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay. Oh my god. Come on, Ashley. Oh my god. No! Oh my god, we're about to die. And Ashley is incapacitated. Ah, uh, use that. Craft. Mix herb. Item ammo. Uh, oh my god, it's where where's the thing? Where is it? I I just freaking lost it. Ah oh, shit. No, ah, oh, crap, really? This. Oh, crap. Oh my god. <sighs> Why am I missing? Now we can go Let's in. Go. Uh, okay. Oh my god! Ashley. Where the heck did they- uh... <laughs> oh, come on, come on, come on, get up, yeah. get up, get up, get up, get up. Where?
I don't even know where the uh, okay. Oh Actually Ah Thanks. Anytime. Oh my god, it's how the heck? You know what? I'm a little confused. I saw the blue um, medallions, but I don't see the the paper for it. Uh, sorry, I'm doing some uni homework, but I'm still hearing your goddamn unique good voice. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, is it hard homework though? It's a summary of the story of Gothic clothes. Ooh. Nice. Wait a second. I just missed these two areas. Mm -mm. <laughs> what? Hold up. Do I get over there? That's definitely not it. How the heck? Let's go up here. No, like, doorway or anything. The only other doorway is, like, this thing, but I can't get there.
Oh, I see, I see, I see, I think. Oh, okay. That's why I, I couldn't figure it out, because I literally just had to jump down here. Anything here? Nope. Even open that. Okay. Oh, uh, what? Oh. That's where that thing was. I just have to figure out how to get over that side, though. Like this. Rifle ammo. Oh. Right as I put the rifle away? Really? You're doing this to me? thing. Elegant bangle. Oh, it's another one of these. Alright, that means we are now back here. Okay, so now I just have to go around. Like, back to the... Back to that one area. Which is like down here. Sapphire. Wait a second. Okay, I don't have enough. Uh. I've reload that. So to do one. Reload. I don't think there's anything here. And I don't think I missed anything. Yeah, okay. So we got the two treasures. Resources. Oh, okay. Uh, those blue medallions have been strung up around the castle by those crazy zealots. They're damn- They're damn- I- ugh. 
I cannot even English. They're a damn eyesore. Someone get them out of out of my sight. Castle Gate, Spinal Five. Okay, so I'm almost there. I missed you. What? How did I get that one? What? It's not even in the castle grounds. And backtrack for a bit to go get those two then. They're both on this side though. Sort of. That way. No. Someone, oh, okay. He's in the stairs. Uh, oh. I found one of them. Did it just get completed? No. Alright, okay, it's not. I don't know why I was like, A. On the stamp. That is weird. I just need the last one then. The last one's like on the staircase? Oh, that's gonna be interesting. Not the staircase. I went the wrong way. Staircase right is literally this one right here. Question is, where exactly is it? Oh, closer to the end. Oh! Literally right there. <laughs> okay, we just we can just we can just continue onward because I think I got everything. Yep. through everything. Is that a deer? Looks like it. Okay. And in we go. Wow. Merchant! What Look the? I mean, it's old, but... What in the world?
took care of her a quest, did ya? <laughs> good stuff, stranger. Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. We like our herbs, we do. Heal a man, kill a man. They do it all. <laughs> Your weapons are in good hands, mate. I'll see you right. What's that? How have we procured these curiosities? <laughs> you don't want to know, mate. No. Because uh, I really want that case, leather case. But I also want that exclusive upgrade ticket. But I also want that stock. But then again, I also want that TMP stock. That cat I don't always have this in stock, stranger. I'll buy almost anything. Well, well. I can certainly do something with this. Will that be all then? Molding of pleasant travels. Okay, uh. Okay, it's gonna be interesting. Oh wait, I should I should save. Oh, I got to the max amount of saves right now. Okay, it tells you how much times you saved. <laughs> 23 times, so okay. Take a look. Something's bound to catch your eye. I mean, that's really cool that there's like a... Ow. Purple slash violet-ish, uh... Fire going on there. <laughs> what? Oh! Interesting. I don't know what exactly this area is supposed to be. Hmm. 
Hmm. All right, I'm gonna actually put something away in the fridge. before I completely forget that I have it out. Ow. Great, my hands now smell like burrito. <laughs> okay, I'll be right back, guys. And we're back. And I'm cold. I'm cold and I have a jacket and a blanket. Jeez. Okay. <sighs> Let's continue onward then. Why is she at the bottom of the stairs? Ah, treasure. Yep, there's treasure all over here. Oh. A most warm welcome to my castle. Such a pleasure to finally make your acquaintance, Mr. Kennedy. Who the hell are you? Me? Oh, please, call me Ramon, and allow me to get straight to the point. I would like you to hand the girl there over to me. Now. Yeah, fat chance, uh. Ramon. The girl's just fine with me. Mr. Kennedy, Mr. Kennedy. You need some cr How facial much? cream, sir. Your face be cracked. Unless you see, the girl must be ours. With a girl as the very source, your United States, and then the entire world shall overflow with his grace. For that, 
is the iron will of my master, the most holy, Lord Sandler. So then, you will comply, yes? No. Never. You heard the lady. How unfortunate. Do make sure our guest feels at home, now that he has chosen death. His white coat is white shirt is uh absolutely dirty as heck. Leon. Just stay close. Not sure if that's blood or something, but eh. Next. Leon, watch out! Oh god, hello there. Are you kidding me? Oh. Oh my god. I missed it for a second there. I love how the merchant is just casually standing there like about the finest way. <laughs> like nothing happened. I see how it is. <laughs> you only help me when I'm I need to buy stuff, is that it? Oh my god, it's my health. Okay. So, machine gun. Is this thing? Huh. Treasure by the looks of it, but I'm gonna have to find the knobs or whatever goes to it. Cool, I don't like that. Really? Uh, it's locked. Oh. Second floor. That key. Gold bar. Oh, okay. Uh, this. Oh, yellow herb. Let's see. Okay, that's locked. locked. There's gotta be another way to get to the courtyard. Come on. Help me up here. Got it. I need you to open it from the other side. Thank you, Ashley. Good work. Okay, uh, can we actually go? Oh.
Change gun. Oh god. Looks like we can continue on this way. Be careful. I don't want to right now. Anyway, there we go. Treasure. I like a perfume bottle. Hey. I might as well go and sell those two things. <laughs> Why not? Welcome. Where would it? What can I do you? Well, this. I'll buy almost. Oh, anything. the alien. Okay. Uh, I'll sell the alien bangle in a second. A well. Don't get yourself. Go. Killed now. <laughs> Flash grenade. Okay. in your pocket or your life easy uh, pleasant trap all right i'm going to get going uh wait a second what square lockbox oh okay then the treasure that i can't Still can't get to. I'll get to it in a bit. Can't get through that door, so we're gonna have to go through here. Through that one area we found. Oh, great. The torture room, what the? <sighs> Poor bastard. That's no way to go. The one thing every castle needs, a torture area, apparently. Caretaker's note. I was awoken in the middle of the night once again. It's those awful noises coming from the basement. The sounds of nails clawing at the stone walls and the writhing moans of curses. That man harbors enough hate to ruin this world. Uh, he once served the lord of the castle as a torturer, like his father and grandfather before him. It's one of those more unsightly legacies left by a Salazar family. Even among his family, he was special. He enjoyed his work wholeheartedly and had a talent for it. He was gifted at tormenting others. His ability soon attracted the master's interest. And when he took him to the dungeon... No, I can't write anymore. I won't. I don't want to recall what happened down there. My mind can't take it. It will break me. I was ordered to attend to him. To feed him. Dispose of the filth. All while listening to that wretched voice every night. I can't take it anymore. I've had enough. I will not tolerate one more night in this castle. I shall leave tomorrow. Go far away, where that voice cannot reach my ears. 
Uh, does that caretaker leave? Are they able to leave? Is the question. Makes it sound like they were. Uh, but then again, the last time we were in a castle and someone tried to escape, they kind of died, so. Finally done with it, and damn, this place looks kinky. Well, I mean, I, I guess, I guess you could say so, because, uh, it's a dungeon. There's multiple different kinds of dungeons that exist, so. Uh. What kind of key does that use? Wait a second. Why is there little check marks on them? I'm very confused. Does that mean I no longer need them? Because, I mean, it's not appearing anymore, so I'm assuming maybe... Maybe I, I don't need it anymore. They had some blast there. A lot of that noise. Oh, hey, it's an Iron Maiden. A very used Iron Maiden. <gasps> what was that? Do they keep animals down here or something? I'm gonna assume it is not an animal. I don't really want to know what it is. I have a bad feeling. Reload that. with that weird tripod thing. The heck is that supposed to be? You supposed to sit on it or something? I'm so confused. That's a dead That's a dead end. Oh no. Got a bad feeling about it. I 
That says I'm more to lose. Yeah, so basically the light yeah, the light has died. I'm a little confused. This is a dead end. Oh, your Spanish pronunciation was super good. Oh, that's because... <laughs> I'm, just, I'm half Hispanic, actually, so I was like... Um, Spanish is... I, so I learned Spanish and English at the same time. And I learned it when I was really little, so... <laughs> So I think that's probably why my pronunciation is pretty good. That and also I, I studied in, in Mexico f when I was little, so. Which honestly, that's... Because I studied in Mexico for a while, that's how I ended up knowing that, um... There's a bit of a difference when it comes to studying over there and studying here in the U.S. Because, um... Because over there... You can choose not to go to school. They won't be like, oh my god, you have to be, to, you have to be at school, whatever. Nope. They're just like, it is a right to go to school, but you can choose not to go. Uh, over here, apparently, they're like, nah, you gotta go to school. Well, like you can choose not to go to um, college or university, but uh, you, you gotta go to school. From what I've heard, if you're young over here in the U.S. and you don't go to school, there's something about like the police or something getting involved if they find out that you that you're not going to school. I'm not entirely sure how true that is, but, like, I don't know. <laughs> In my country, I can decide to not go if I don't want to. See me in university? Hmm. But yeah, I um I studied in Mexico for most of my childhood and then I um I studied uh I studied high school and a bit of college here in the US. I skipped a year though because uh years in school years in um in Mexico are a little bit different compared to um to the US and they're like you, you can't be a freshman or else you're gonna be behind everyone so I started in second year of a uh, of high school instead uh that and also because I already had the the stuff I needed to learn from first year basically Honestly, it'd be nice if university here in the U.S. was free. Honestly, I think more people would go to university if it was free. But it's so freaking expensive. And then... Because, like, a lot of people, when they go to school, most of the time, they're either... Well, it's not free-free. You have a test. What do you mean? As in, like, you can only do it once a year? Well, 
Wait, so are you meaning that the test is not is like what you have to pay for or the classes are what you have to pay for? Uh, it's a test to get a score, and that score will tell you if you can enter the career you want. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, you don't have to pay a lot? $3 for the test? Uh... Dollars? I'm going to say three in question. Uh, example, I had to do that test three times to enter to my art career because I'm quite... <laughs> Wait, so you have to... You have to do the test to get to, get to your art career? That's... What the heck would you even... What the heck would they even test you for art? That's kind of weird. Like, I'd get it if they were like, oh, you're going to be a mathematician or something. Or like a scientist or, uh, 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 or, I don't know, a teacher or something. I, I'd get that, but that's a universal test. That's a, Oh! Wait, that even, that makes even less sense. Because <laughs> there's a, like... There's a lot of things that you would require for a lot of other careers that you would not require for art. <laughs> so it's something called logical Spanish and logical math. Mmm. Oh, okay. wow. Yeah, no, over here in the US, you gotta pay for... You gotta pay for the school itself like attending the school and then you have to pay for each credit you take and not not by like um oh a class has like whatever three credits or something and you have to pay for like each credit no i mean as in you have to pay for the class i think i think i think that's how I, how it went i don't remember i, I didn't go to uni I, I went to college uh, yeah, and then it's like, and then usually, um, usually counselors will tell you don't go above five cl uh, classes because it can get really, really stressful, but most students will be like, I can like end my school year faster if I do more. So they do like 9 to 10 ish or even more classes that and then they also do summer classes which you don't have to attend summer of uni but some people just do it so that they can end co uh, school faster basically. And it's like it's absolutely bonkers. The prices are freaking bonkers because it's it's probably, honestly, the prices to go to a school, a university over here in the U.S. for four years is probably about the same price to buy a house, probably. Or at least pay toward buying a house. And it's like, uh, a lot of people either... If you have the money to pay for school, it's like, yeah, great, awesome. But most people don't. So a lot of them will, like, if they don't have a scholarship, a lot of them have to um, get a loan from from the government, basically. And then they have to pay the freaking loan once they get out of school. So during school time and then after they get out of school, they're going to be in debt for, like, years <laughs> And it's, it's so painful, too, to, like, hear about, because it's, like, I had a, when I was in high school, my history teacher was talking about how, oh, she was, you know, uh, 
she'd already been a teacher for a few years now, but she's still paying off her freaking bills to school. <laughs> she's still in debt. It's just like, oh my freaking god, like you're you're over here trying to get money to like live your life uh, and pay for your basic necessities and, and stuff. And then you have to pay the government because because you went to school. It's like, come on, really? It's like, I get it if they did it where, if they did a thing where they were like, hey, um, that sounds like hell. Yeah, it's, it's absolutely horrible. Like, there's so many things over here that are so friggin' expensive, and people are just like, why? <laughs> it's like, it's so bad that whenever, like, Americans in general go out of the, of the, of US and go into like Europe or something to like travel and then they end up having to go to a hospital or something they just freaking do a double take because they're like why is it so freaking cheap over there why is everything like much cheaper it's like it's cheaper to go to the hospital over there and over here over no over here in the US apart from like schooling being expensive Going to the hospital is expensive. You getting an ambulance ride is expensive. It's so freaking expensive that people would rather be like, no, I'll drive to the hospital even if I'm like bleeding to death. Because they don't want to freaking pay the the, the expense of the of the ambulance. I, I I don't even remember how how much uh, an ambulance ride is actually. Um, Uh... <laughs> okay, so basically, uh, actually, hospitals here is also free. Of course, you have to pay your taxes, but they don't charge you for ambulance. Yeah, that's the that's the interesting thing about it, because it's like it makes sense that you'd have to pay the taxes, obviously. But it's like. No, over here it's absolutely terrible. It's like over here. An ambulance ride, like over average, costs around one thousand two hundred dollars for a ride. That's not that's not even taking into consideration the mileage of how far the car is going or the specific services used for it. So it can be even more expensive than like 1200 That's just like base price. So basically, if you tell them to go to a certain hospital and that one hospital that you wanted to go to is uh, full and they have to go to another hospital that's like farther away, they're going to make you pay for that, you know, that mileage difference. And I think that's different per, um... I bol- yeah, I believe, uh... It's- prices are different depending on which state you're in in the U.S. too. Yeah. Like, for example, uh, in one state, per mile, uh, price is around $22.88 per mile in one state. Um, in another state, um, 
it costs about 10 to 16 per mile. And then in another state, it costs about a... Uh, Oh, I'm not sure what it's, that one says. Uh oh, and another one it says uh 11.25 per mile. <laughs> and that's literally from the place they pick you up to the hospital you go to. That sounds pretty dangerous for debts. Yeah, it's... Mm. And that is why over here in the U.S., people, if they don't have insurance, they avoid as much as possible having to take an ambulance. They will literally do whatever they can to not take an ambulance. A private doctor is cheaper. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure what the prices are for doc actual doctor visits. I don't remember. Um... But if you're paying out of pocket, you have to do like copays and stuff, basically. Oh god, private doctors. <laughs> it reminds me of like me and when me and my roommate went to uh, France and he was sick during the trip. Like he got super sick during the trip. And uh, I don't remember if he could... I don't remember exactly what he was sick with. But um... I ended up going to the front desk of the hotel we were staying at, and I was like, oh my god, we, like, could, could you call, like, an ambulance or something, or, um, or, you know, if there was, like, a way to call a doctor, or, or like, figure out where the nearest hospital or whatever it was, and they're like, oh, we can call a doctor, and I was like, D is a doctor actually gonna come over here? I, I, I don't know, right? And the, the freaking doctor actually came to, to our freaking hotel room, which was absolutely freaking surprising to me, mostly. Uh, <laughs> and he didn't speak a lick of English, but he was trying so hard. And he was legit pl basically playing charade with, charades with us. <laughs> um, and... Well, he, he sort of spoke a little, very a little English, like really bad. But he was he was really trying. Uh, <laughs> and then there's this like, he was like, oh well, well, I'm gonna give you like this medication, you know, for. T I, no wait, he didn't. He wasn't giving us medication. He um, he prescribed medication basically for my roommate, and was like, oh, you gotta go to like the, the pharmacy or that's like nearby or here, and and get this thing right. And he was like, he didn't know the name for, um, I don't even know the name of it. Crap. Uh, oh, inhaler. He needed an inhaler, basically. And he was like, he didn't know the name of it. So he was just like, oh, you gotta get the t -t -t -t. And I was just like, oh my freaking god. <laughs> I was just like, th this guy just made my day. <laughs> yeah, there was an attempt. There was a full-on attempt. I, I just could not even. 
That was like my first ever encounter with like European doctors in, in a sense because I'd never really encountered any European doctors. Um, so, <laughs> but he was like super nice too, and and he was like full on trying. So like we totally totally appreciated that. Spread out. Oh okay. no. Hey. Oh, that's a nice looking key. Oh god! Oh gods. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, but that was some goofy acting for sure. Oh, God. Uh, the first guy to sleep at the sleepover would be like, Oh god. No! Oh my god, that was painful. That was absolutely painful. Oh no, that was horrible. Huh? I need to use throwables on him. I don't think I have any other throwables. <laughs> oh, maybe, actually, maybe I could use the bolt throwers. Oh no, I ran out. I ran out. I ran out.
Uh. Oh my god, no! 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 Oh! E! Oh my gods! How the heck? How did he know? How did he know? How did he know? Ah. <sighs> I don't have any more throwables. Uh. Oh, a little too close. A little too close. Too close. Bro isn't blind. He's blind. He, uh... His hearing is good, though. Well, it's not blind. It's more so that he's, uh... His eyes were sewn shut. Really, that's what it is. Oh. Oh, don't tell me that I have to. Oh, don't tell me that's gonna make a lot of noise. It's, is it? Yeah, I feel like it is. Oh, shit. E. Oh shit. Damn it. Ah fuck. Oh crap. Okay. Did you attack us back? No, I have not. Oh shit. No. No, 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 no. No, no. Oh. Oh, this is a bad spot to be in. I'm cornered. I am literally cornered. Uh, 
I need to do this very, very gently and slowly. Oh, okay. And give myself as much time as I can. Oh shit. Just have to wait. Ah! Okay, okay, no, but fuck! Oh my god, no! No, that was absolutely terrible. Apparently terrible. Nope. Nope. My heart is racing right now. Crap, that did nothing. I use effort and the, uh. Oh, come on. Oh crap. Ah uh, ha ha. Oh shit. No. It's gonna make a lot of noise. Oh, okay. We got it. <laughs> that was horrifying. Good game. <laughs> I took a bit though. Oh. Ashley, we're back. Let me just uh Oh it's you. What happened down there? Nothing. <laughs> we're right about the animals though. Yeah, totally. It was just an animal. <laughs> okay. Map updated. Gunpowder. What the? Okay. With me. Come on, Ashley. Oh, okay. she's really not doing well. I'm fine. Well, for now. Stop lying. I know you're not doing well. You're coughing. You're coughing up a storm. You sound like death.
Oh. Uh, achievement unlocked. Revolt against the revolting. She asked Cockbag eleven. What? Oh, silver token. No problem. Flash grenade. Come on, really? <sighs> I missed the treasure. Where is them? Where did I miss it? Oh, but I... Oh, no. I don't want to backtrack. I really don't want to backtrack. Wow. Look at all of this. Pretty paintings. Isn't that much. Iron sword. Oh. Huh. A rugged iron sword has been dulled for display and cannot be used as a weapon. Rusted sword. Huh. Golden sword. Oh. Oh, it's like a puzzle. And then I'll open this door. Okay. Seen paintings up there. I don't like that painting. What? the heck? Oh. <laughs> so there's three little lamps I have to basically turn on. Okay. Bring those bombs by shooting them. Well, that makes sense. That doesn't look right. I don't know what that is. Oh, okay. There's an extra gong for some apparent reason. Oh, okay. So it's not small and then big. Okay. It's just... It's in specific order. Basically. Oh, um.
bloodied sword. What's that used for? Well, it's just a replica. Only a couple of uses for it. Um, was that there the whole entire time? This artwork. I don't think it was. Doesn't it look like it's telling some kind of story? Uh. <laughs> Rusted sword. Golden sword. And bloodied sword, I think. Yep. That seemed right. Hi, trees. Not that I didn't answer my question. Well, if I get hungry again, I have a a, um, a burrito in the fridge. Gold mango. Consume. Oh my god. A double consume? Oh my god. We just circled around. Um, there's a snake. What? Doesn't look like the snake is on that end. It's an eagle. Uh, 
Don't even think about trying this yourself. Me? As if. Leon, are you kidding me? Jumping across chandeliers, seriously, who does that? <laughs> me, apparently. What are you, my mother? Uh. Gunpowder. Okay. Uh, oh. I want to do it again. Oh, okay. Gold and iron glass. Nice. <laughs> Why not treat yourself, Bane? Ah, uh, let's see. Can I sell, sell the gold bangle, sell the golden hourglass, and the velvet blue. Ruby's all rubbish. It makes no difference. The price, well, that's our choice. A deal well struck. <laughs> Knife needs care every once in a while. Could be the difference between life and death. This kind Boy. of work is about Mwah. finesse, stranger. Mwah. Little bit goes a long way. You'll see. Dazzled, are you? <laughs> Our craftsmanship demands no less. This kind of work is about fit on a selection of come back any time. Welcome. Anything? Uh, no, no, nothing new. Okay. All my wares are in tip top shape, I assure you. <laughs> Suit yourself, stranger. Wait a second. Wait Welcome. a second. What can I interest you in? Like That's that. an exemplary firearm right there. Stranger. Oh, shit. Not the best, sure. But she'll make you an ideal. Don't get yourself killed now. <laughs> I'll put that away, though. Storage. Why didn't... Why is it... Why is there ammo in it? <laughs> uh, tell me a fact about Sheep's of Wars. Fun fact about me. Hmm. Hmm. I'm allergic to toothpaste? What? Um... I think I've... The last time I did a fact, I think it was a... Sheep fact? Was it a wolf fact? I don't remember. Yeah, because then how are you gonna wash your teeth? Alright, so I do wash my teeth, it's just painful. Ugh, that really sucks. Uh, so wolves can actually swim up to 8 miles. And they do not hibernate, so they can potentially be seen all year long.
They also run on their toes and not on their pads. I didn't expect that last toe thingy. <laughs> I know, right? You usually, whenever you see dogs, they usually like run on their little pa um, toe pads. But apparently wolves don't. Uh, fun fact about cats. After all these years with cats, we still can't understand their behavior. Like, at all. <laughs> Makes sense. A lot of cats are very different, too. Some are very sociable, and then others are like, don't even touch me, don't even look at me. <laughs> It's like, god oh, damn, cat. Why? Why you be like this? I think I got... Oh, I think I got every... Spot for the... I don't have the thing for this box though which I need to find Oh, okay. Uh, if you cook cow liver, the smell is pretty similar to human brain smell. A bit bizarre. <laughs> that does sound very bizarre. What the heck? I, uh, also, I can confirm because my brother had to work with a brain. Mmm.
I've never seen a brain up close, but I've seen a heart up close. It was in like middle school, and our uh, our teacher promised that she would bring us a uh, a heart to dissect, and, and she did. If I remember correctly, it was um, it was also a human heart, basically. Uh it was donated, obviously. And we were, it was just one, and we were allowed to actually like cut into it and stuff. Hmm. Another fun fact. Hmm. If you lose your ear, but you still have it, the doctors will implant your ear in, in your stomach so it can regenerate. Oh yeah, I think I've heard about something like that too. I don't know how to proceed. Hmm. Yeah, because I... Uh, that's still locked. Um... Hmm... Where's the ladder? Cross between the hanging lamps. The hanging lamps? Oh. It was probably the other- oh, wait, no. Okay. Door. <laughs> Thank you. <all. laughs> Get out of my way, Ashley. book. Parasites in their ecology volume 2. Where's volume 1? Uh, there are some parasites that have the ability to control their hosts. Uh, this is basic knowledge among most biolo biologists, but not much is known as to how the parasites do it. Yes. 
the we we know about that the the, the cordyceps parasite. <laughs> uh, the following is a list of several such parasites. Dicrocoelium? Maybe? I, I don't know. Scientific names. <laughs> Once the larvae of this parasite migrate to the ant's esophagus, they alter the behavior of the ant. When the temperature drops in the evening during peak grazing hours, the infected ant, ant climbs to the top of the plant and clamps onto a leaf using its mandible with the intention of being eaten. It's not doing throws? Hmm. Give me one second. It should be working. Oh, there you go. I don't know why it's it wasn't working. Hold on. Let me re... Let me see if that worked. Uh... Honestly... It's not you, it's um... Oh, there we go. For some reason, some of my stuff has been like... Borking? All day? Ah, uh, the scamming Eldrick being on the game chair. JK, JK, it's okay. <laughs> no, like, seriously. So for some reason, like, a, a lot of my applications have been kind of borking all day for some reason. And th that and also, um, my stream died once today, and I don't know why. I'm, I'm still very confused. Uh, okay, so then there's... Galactosomum? The larvae of this parasite make their home inside the brain of a fish such as yellowtail and the parrot bass. Once infected, the fish makes its way up to the water surface where it will swim until eaten by seabirds. Uh, Leocochloridium? Uh, this parasite's uh, sporocysts develop in the snail's eye stalks, where the they pulsate like worms. They alter the snail's behavior and force it to move to the top of of a plant to make it more visible to birds. Once eaten by a bird, the parasite will complete its metamorph metamorphosis into an adult. What? So basically, most of these basically get a uh, nom nom. That's basically the whole purpose of of them, apparently. To get nom nom. Delicious? Nope. No, thank you. Oh, wait. Save. And those parasites are actually real? Oh. Just like the cordyceps, basically? That's locked. Interesting. Is there anything in here other than the... Nope, no, it isn't. Okay. Can't do anything with that. The snail one is super weird looking because it replaces the eyes of the snail. Hmm, makes sense. But it would be weird looking. Uh, 
Excuse me? Why'd the color of everything just change? Okay, so it's like softly brightish, like yellowish. But then once I get closer, it turns more greenish. What the heck? It's so freaking weird. Oh, gross. Ew. Black stuff. Hi, Cyan Blue. Welcome in. There's a bunch of black ooze. The evil acting. I now regret not having my, um... The rifle with me. Been a bit? Definitely. Have you been? Oh, he's too far. Don't see anyone up there. Is that the only dude here? Oh, I missed. I missed again. It's hard to hit his head when I'm- oh god, no. Uh, been alright, quite busy. How about you? Uh... Life's been absolutely chaotic, mostly because of work being like, oh yeah, weird. <laughs> Honestly, I swear to God. So my work has been like, they signed me on for 40 hours. When I first started working. But then they were like, they haven't been giving me 40 hours. They haven't even been giving me the minimum, which is supposed to be 20 hours. Uh, yesterday I got my... Well, not technically yesterday, because it's no longer Friday. <laughs> sort of, right? It's 12.50-something. It's Saturday. It's Saturday. Uh... But basically, what happened is... They... I checked my schedule, because... I just got the new schedule for, for work. And they only gave me five hours. On Monday. That's it. <laughs> and I'm like, what the heck, you know? Yeah! What the heck? I don't get it. I'd be more understanding if the new girl from my department was also getting really horrible shitty hours, but she isn't. She's not getting horrible hours. She's getting more hours than I am, and I've been working there longer than she has. The only difference between us is the fact that she's very chummy with the manager. She's very chummy with the manager, and I don't know if they're friends or relatives. So I'm wondering if it's nepotism or something. I don't know. It makes me feel like they want me to quit so that they don't have to pay me. Uh, do you still get the money, though? I don't get the money for, like, 40 hours. Or 20. I'm getting only what I'm... The hours... I'm only getting paid for what I'm working, basically. Uh... The hell, I highly recommend checking other jobs. <laughs> yeah, it's like... Oh, my God. And yet, they, they always say that, oh, um... They don't have hours at my at my job. But then they're always trying to hire new people, so it's like what the heck, you know? If you don't have hours, why the heck are you trying to get new people? You get it figured out now? Well, a while back. I told my manager that I was fine with getting cross-trained for any other department, and I never heard back. And yet the new girl got cross-trained for the department I was supposed to get uh, cross-trained for. So I'm just like, what the fuck, you know? <laughs> yeah, it, it's not like I'm a bad worker or anything. I'm always doing, like... I'm always doing my job. 
I'm always on time. So I don't I don't understand. I haven't even asked for like a days off either. I also go in on my days off whenever I get called in. Because one of my coworkers is a little bit um, flaky. Mostly on the weekends. <laughs> uh, sounds like favoritism. They sound like they're trying to either push you out or keep you only for backup. I know. That's what it feels like. And I, I'm only trained to basically be the closing shift. Because they never trained me for an opening shift. Honestly, it makes me feel like they're trying to make me quit so that they, don't, they really don't have to pay me for um, unemployment, basically. That is literally what it feels like. And yes, I would try to go find another job, but the problem is... The last time I had a full-time job that wasn't the current one I'm in, I was having multiple panic attacks per day. And I literally cried when I went in to, like, quit the day of. Also, I was, like, really scared of my manager back then. <laughs> I had a scary manager. Really? Nice shot. You are. What the heck is this thing? They're here. Ah, the entertainment. Oh, shit. No. Oh, fuck. Oh, come on. Wait, where'd she go? Where are you? Okay, right, there we go. Actually, still incapacitated. Oh. Ashley, are you all right? Yeah. Thanks. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Welcome in, Ray Threadpath. Uh, this is what most companies do now. If they want someone gone, they just make the work environment hostile until people quit. Yeah. They're not even like making the work environment hostile. Like they're. The work environment is really, really nice.
like all of my coworkers are super nice the um the manager gets super chummy with everyone and she like outwardly acts nice to everyone uh no one ever like shit talks anyone basically <laughs> other than like me and one of my coworkers talking about like our <laughs> our um uh, our lead because she's she's so flaky i swear <laughs> I mean, at least she still gets the job done, but, eh. Oh, shit. Come on, Ashley, come on. Come on, keep on moving. Oh, Jesus. A little too close. Oh god! Oh fuck. Entirely sure if that's it. Uh, I just hope everything gets figured out. Yeah, honestly, same. Also, the, the other reason why I really like it is because I don't have to deal with people. <laughs> I absolutely hate dealing with people at work. Even more so because, like, I always get people either asking me stupid questions at work. Or people saying really weird and creepy things, but that's just something I've gotten used to at this point. What the heck? I don't see anyone. <laughs> um, how are these things tanking headshots? I don't know. Because raisins- <laughs> Raisins? I'm also running the, the R9 and not, you know, the, the shotgun. Oh, I'm slowly running out of ammo. I mean, I could tell you the lower reasons, but that would be spoilers and I don't do that. Me, personally, I'm, per I'm usually pretty chill about spoilers, but, uh, I don't know about everyone else. I literally have zero knowledge of the game, Leo. Honestly, same. It's my first time playing Resident Evil 4, so. All I know is that there's a few key differences between this version of Resident Evil 4 compared to the original. That's it. That's all I know. And that apparently they um the voice actor for Ada Wong is also different in this game, apparently. That that's all I know. What? Seriously, I missed that? Oh crap. Okay, I gotta go back and get it. I thought this is just a remake. Oh it is! It is a remake, but there's a few differences here and there. 
Like they uh they also changed the the music for the game. Oh, there it is. Why the heck is it not on the ceiling? Also, yes, I know my sh my shooting is absolutely terrible in this game. Honestly, at least it's not as bad as um my shooting in uh, Apex. Like, I guess. <laughs> Why is the music all going like uh I'm gonna hold on for a second. Oh there's a Did I break everything? No I didn't. Gotta make sure I get all that loot. Uh very low on ammo. Yeah. I mean, again, if you want to know the lore reasons why they can survive bullets to the face, I could tell you, but I would refrain unless asked. Okay. <laughs> okay, for a second, I, I misheard that. I started out if that's actually what they were talking about and actually meaning, it would be absolutely hilarious. But it is not. Uh, also, I love your setup. Very clean. <laughs> it took me a while to figure out how to properly set this up, like the bottom part. A lot of it I had to basically learn from either just a uh, fiddling around and stuff and just googling shit. <laughs> My kneecaps! <laughs> no. No. Oh, Come on, open up. I stuck. Get down. Thank you. Oh, come on. Open up. Open up. Open up. I said open up. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Please, no. Oh, I missed! Oh, that was horrifying. That was absolutely terrifying. Oh, hello there. It sounds like the music saying ah. <laughs> Give me that. This should do the trick. You don't need it. <laughs> but I do.
us. Probably should have made more flash grenades, but oh well. Oh, okay. Gave it. Oh, okay. I see why I gave it back. Where the oh. Oh gods! You dick! No, 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 no! Oh my gods! Are you kidding me? Oh fuck! Oh my god! You... No! Oh you! Nope! 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 That is not good time to be reloading. Get over here. Come on, bitch. Come on. Oh, come on. Really? Oh, God. My back? Really? Does it seriously have to be on my back? Oh, God. Oh, are you kidding me? Nope. Hey, Ashley. You hurt? Uh, no, I'm okay. Uh, all right. Have a good one. I'm gonna get some sleep. All right. Have a good, have some good sleep. Oh, and thank you so much for the follow. I hope you enjoy your stay here in the Sheep Wolf Cottage. Oh my God. Nope. Not on my watch. Get away, lady. Oh my god! No. Oh, oh, my mom fire. No! Oops. That's what I get for not paying attention to my health. <laughs> I did not pay attention to my health. Oops. Honestly, I should have. I had already gotten beaten up multiple times. <laughs> Is Ashley invincible? No, she's not. <laughs> not that I know of. I think she can get killed. I think the enemies on this side are already downed. Okay. So it should be fine. Oh. Come on. Open up. It's not going to open up, is it? Oh, come on. No. Why is that one just closed? Hey.
Uh. Okay, weird. Oh, wait, no, I can't look down from... Oh, I might be able to, actually. the fuck their master of like bullets yeah it's so freaking weird I'm going to have to actually jump down aren't I uh, well here goes nothing No, 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 fuck. Come on, Ashley, come on. Come on, both of you, come on, I need you to get over. Ah, oh, no, you won't eat, oh. You're gonna do what I think you're gonna do, aren't you? Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Crap, are you kidding me? Wait, how about I just... This way... And then just wait for you guys to come over here. Come on, come on. Get closer, get closer! As close as you can! Well, that took out one of them. There's the other one. Good. Perfect. to go upstairs. Sucks, because now I have to deal with more enemies. This should do the trick. Ah, <sighs> okay. We can do this. Break this off. Oh, guys. Nope, nope. Crap. Come on, open up, open up, open up. Come on, open up. Yes. Ah, 
Oh my god, are you kidding me? I was still- I was walking away. Okay, come on. Come on, Ashley. Oh, come on. Ashley! No. Where's it? The oh, they're up there? Oh, come on. I have no ammo for that. Okay. Okay, she's down. Good. Okay, she is down. Now we need to get to the other floor, so do the thing. Okay, health wise, though. So far. I'm gonna save that grenade for later. See. And finally run up here and just grab stuff. That music is making me nervous. Okay, we're good so far. Apparently. Is 
Ugh, there's black stuff all over the place. Ah. What? There's a thing up there and this. Oh. Some powder? No, that's not it. Uh. Shotgun ammo. Oh. Alright, come on. No problem. You're gonna be okay? Yeah, I I, I got this. You sure? I'll cover you. Oh Don't shit. Stop. Oh shit. Uh no, 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 no. Oh, crap. Uh. Hang on. Uh. I got you. Oh, my God. Oh my god, okay, come on. Oh crap. Oh fuck. Ah oh, shit, oh god. Oh crap. Kidding me? Okay, get back here. Oh shit. Come on, Ashley. Come on. Oh. Got it. Hurry up. Okay. Uh. 
I don't think they're actually coming after us anymore. Okay. It's fine. Okay. Uh, I say that, yeah, but like over there. Oh, yeah, I know they're coming over this way. We're going. We're leaving. Go through here. Yeah. Um. Well, that, was that area, that that area is really big. Come on. It gives me Hang on. boss vibes. area okay it just looked like a boss area for some reason it is like a courtyard or something no no it isn't we're going into what it looks like a garden oh no never mind we are in the courtyard <laughs> looks like the right place you okay I think so. Uh, oh no. Instead of worrying about her, worry about your own skin. Foolish little lamb. Uh, temperance, child. Oh no. Oh no, she's gonna run away, isn't she? Wait. No. Yeah. Dang it, Ashley. Shit. Oh, chapter end. The game. Oh wait. Uh. Dang it, Ashley. Roost, come in. Things went to shit. We took refuge inside a castle, but I've just been separated from Baby Eagle. Say you. Roost, you're breaking up. Do you read me? Or what? Yeah. Chopper. Damn it. So much for that. Be 
sheets. Beesh. <gasps> I can knife fish, apparently. <laughs> All right, so. Been a rough day, stranger. Yep, definitely could say that. Welcome. I've got something new for you, mate. Oh, Matilda. Oh, Give all the shooting three round bursts on the stock. Arc is attached. Years hmm. haven't been kind to us, I suppose. Oh, the red nine stock. I do use Come the red nine a lot, so. Body armor. All my wares are in tip top shape. I don't worry. I offer repair hmm. services as well. Oh, okay. We are poor right now. Without Ooh. the necessary funds, I'm afraid we don't have a deal. I know. I know. A well tuned weapon can make up for a lack of skill, friend. Ruby's all rubbish. She makes no difference. Are you trying to say what I think you're trying to say? That's come back. It... Oh, gods. Oh, it can be used to restore health? Okay. Huh. Okay. Well, that's gonna be interesting. I have no space. I have no space for anything right now. Ah. <sighs> uh... Need time. Reload this. Oh, that is weird looking. Uh, I'm just going to save on top of this thing. <laughs> Onward we go. Oh, okay. So there's going to be a treasure up ahead. Um...
These guys aren't alive, are they? Nope, they're not alive. That is locked, which means I gotta go around through here, apparently. Consign the crimson flame. The voice of pestilence dwells in the flames, leading the pitiful souls to salvation. Consign the crimson and flame to its rightful place, for you shall be enlightened and the path revealed. What? Oh. I have to go grab something and put it there. Okay. Oh my god, no! Oh fuck! No! Oh fuck! No! Oh my god. Ah! No! Oh gods! Oh my god, no, no, no. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit.
Oh, fuck. Come on. Open your mouth again. Open it. Open it. Open it. Open. Ugh. Oh, come on. Open it. much ammo. Oh, okay. 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 Oh, lots of stuff I've missed here and there. What is this? Oh, seriously? I had that there the whole entire time that I could have used. And yet I didn't. <laughs> Ladder. Mirror with Pearls and rubies. A. Hey. I didn't even use the grenades. <laughs> okay. Where is the ex Oh, the exit. I just forgot. I need to basically backtrack. There we go. Okay, it's this area. That means there is that door and this door. It doesn't have anything to it, so I can't. I can't put stuff in it. All right. Oh, 
Oh, cutscene. Six years, that is one hell of a greeting, Ada. You don't seem surprised. Interesting. <laughs> Try using knives next time. Better for close encounters. Not a bad move. Very smooth. So who are you working for this time? Oh, Leon. You know I don't work in town. Leave the girl. She's lost no matter what. You walk away now. And who knows? Maybe you'll live to meet me again. And then I might get you that greeting you were looking for. You think I'm gonna give up that easy? Right. How about we continue this discussion another time? <sighs> and she's gone. Just as fast as she came Last in. Last person I thought I'd run to here. Oh. It doesn't want me to jump out. Okay. No key. Let the graphics don't see. Oh. Silver token. Driving clock. Is that? Oh, yep, it is. Apparently. Okay. Oh, okay. No, wait, no. This one I'm missing. What the heck? Gap in the wall and a treasure? What?
Oh, okay, it's this one. Uh, I need Ashley. No, nothing there. Okay. Interesting. That's interesting, though. Because where the heck is it? Why do I have two sword ones, though? Hmm. Oh. All right. Need to find Ashley. Again. Those three, too. Hear the signal echo through the mountains. Rocks become gravel and the castle walls crumble. Behold the crimson shade of the night sky. A river of tainted blood uh, befalls the sea. Uh, sacrifice your life in the blood of your enemy. Atone for your ancient sins. Huh. Uh. Come on, what?
something scurried around here. Ooh, small key, okay. Mmm. Uh, the rats. The heck was that about? Open that up. Give me some goodies. Press bucket watch. Okay. Well, I definitely have quite a bit of items to sell. The next time I see the, the merchant. <laughs> I have a bad feeling. Oh my god. Christ. Yep, I had a bad feeling. Oh my god. Oh, come on. No. No, come on. No. No. Oh no. Ah. Oh, Jesus. Okay. That was horrifying. That was absolutely horrifying. I don't have... I'm I'm getting low on ammo again. <laughs> I already have a fear of yeah, definitely. I already have a fear of spiders. The fact that there's like that freaking giant ass creepy crawly around no. And I'm going to assume it's not going to be the last time we're going to see those. Oh, breaks over, I suppose. Hey. On sale, stranger. So this Ruby's all rubbish. She makes no this. difference. The price, well, this. that's our choice to make. I think that's all the stuff I can sell right now. I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Anything else I can help you with? Come back any time. Oh. I didn't drop any goodies. Oh, you were 
expecting me. Nah. Oh shit! Oh crap! Give me a break already! No. Come on. No. Ugh. Oh, I forgot Jesus. I literally just said that we were probably gonna see it again, and we did. That moon looks like an oval. Looks like an egg. Excuse me? I like gushing sounds. Ah! I hate it. I hate it. I absolutely freaking hate it. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Nope, 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 nope. Uh. I have to, oh my god, it's no. Dude, come on. Ah. Shit. Ah. 
Oh, okay. I don't have any. I don't have anything to make ammo. I am horribly low on ammo. This is not a good sign. Maybe the top one opened. Hey, okay. Hey, okay. Don't know if this is gonna open, but anyways. I'm gonna go down here. I'm actually, I'm curious. Does that door open if I... No, it doesn't. Okay. So no matter what, I have to go down. Out to the other door. What's my health at? Okay, my health's fine. For now. Well then. Okay, he's down. Or she, I, I don't really know. They're down, basically. Uh... I'm so low on ammo. It's- Oh shit! No! 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 Ah, crap. Oh god! No. No. No! have the knife knives actually right now I only have one knife oh crap at this point I should probably just start using the bolts
this up. I just... Oh, I missed something. How did I miss something? Oh, I missed anything. Weird. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Come on. Really? No ammo? Well, shite. See, 
anything. No, crap. Oh my god. Horrifying. And more so because I have no ammo. Oh my god! Oh, are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding? How? Oh my god. Freaking kidding me? How? How? How the heck did he hit me? Oh my god. I don't get it because I wasn't in line of sight. Also, I don't know how he can accurately know exactly where I'm gonna be to be able to throw it. No! That doesn't make sense. Oh, oh fuck. Oop! Oh, come on. What? Oh. Oh my god! He just threw! Ah, oh my god. Uh, no! Are you kidding me? How the hell? Uh, what? What just happened? Literally, what the heck just happened? What? What the? That, no. Mm -mm, that should not have happened. What the heck is that bullcrap? What is this bullcrap? Oh my god, no! What is this bullshit? Holy shit. Uh. Oh my god. Ah! Okay. 
Okay. Oh, freaking Jesus. Ah. This big guy's gonna be the death of me, I swear. Literally the death of me. Alright, so fish. You know the absolute trash that is my currently in my inventory right now. Yep, this thing is definitely going to be the death of me, I swear. Uh... Oh god, are you kidding me? Oh my god! Uh... What? Where do I go? Oh no. Oh, okay, I'm a bit confused. There's a ladder here? I'm supposed to use the ladder. Huh? Where's the supposed ladder? Oh, seriously? Oh, fuck. Oh. Okay. I don't have a key for this. Oh shit, hello there. Where'd you come from? Oh shit. Oh shit, no. Hi there.
I have no more slow machine gun ammo. One, reload. Okay. Ah. more. Oof. Nothing here. Huh. Okay, okay, okay. Mm. Where was he again? Oh, there he is. Get ready. Ah, ha, ha. Ah. Oh. Cannon. Cannonball. <laughs> there goes the other door down. All right, open for traffic. Oh hi. I think that's it. Oh, Ashley's over there. Okay. Oh, Is there any ammo here? If I fully got. Okay, no. Doesn't look like it. Oh god. Well, that's Sorry. horrifying. I've had my fill of you guys. Oh, can't even see it. <laughs> Why is it so dark in here? It was like extra dark in here. Ooh, very leather-ish looking jackets.
Oh, we're finally actually inside the... Fully inside of the castle. Yeah, we're like in the middle area. Huh, interesting. Ashley, where are you? Mm. What is that? Oh, they're rolled up flags. Okay. The grunts he does, though. <laughs> It was nothing. Oh. Let's <laughs> stay back. I might hurt you again. I'm so scared. When that happened, it wasn't myself anymore. Something else. Uh, she must have been terrifying. I, I know. You too? It's okay to be afraid, you know. But you can't run. You gotta keep moving forward. We will beat this. Together. He's got like a little freckle thing going on on his neck. <laughs> I don't know if I can. You can. Just give me a heads up before you stab me next time, okay? <laughs> Leon, I... thanks. Oh, chapter end. Hey. Save game. Okay. Oh, shit. <sighs> Wait, what time is it? Oh, shit. It's almost 3 a.m. Alright. 
Uh, I'm gonna end stream here, guys. For now. <laughs> I'll probably stream more today. Later today, technically. Probably. Yeah. Okay. Anyways. Uh... Oh, it's already chapter 9, but it looks a bit... Oh, well. Anyways, we're gonna raid out for the night. <laughs> uh, I'm not entirely sure who's on. Just give me one second, guys. Let's see. Uh... Hmm. <laughs> okay, let's read this person. Um, I've I've never read this person, so it's gonna be interesting. They are currently doing- also playing this game right now, so let's go give him some... Some... Lots of attention, basically. <laughs> Alright. Uh, here's the raid, and here's the raid message, guys. Thank you guys so much for coming in and hanging out with me. Um, I, I, I'm still kind of salty that stream got nerfed once as we were starting it through it but um eh, at least we got through quite a bit anyways other than that thank you guys so much uh make sure to stay well hydrated uh get lots of make sure to also eat well and stay healthy guys and i shall see you guys on the next one with more shenanigans bye everyone <laughs>